farming has faced massive changes in the last two decades. And the most recent green thinking blames cattle for the harmful gases. Former Agricultural Minister for Northern Ireland, Edwin Putz, believes the evidence is not convincing. I worked quite a bit on the whole environment thing as well as the agriculture side. And I was never convinced by the evidence uh, that was produced that uh, animals, um, cattle in particular, are the significant contributors uh, to the whole climate change uh, debate that uh, others are, are claiming it to be. They engage in a circular system in that they uh, eat grass, which captures carbon, um, so they emit methane, um, but then they eat the grass again that's already captured the carbon. Uh, so the, the cattle are involved in a circular system. The Netherlands is globally recognised as a farming powerhouse, producing over 6% of EU food. This part of Holland is over 4.5 metres below sea level. It's renowned for its green and renewable policies. But farmers here believe that the government's newest restrictions on methane and nitrogen will drive up the price of dairy and put them out of business. When I have to uh, cut back my herd by 10%, my income will go down 10% or more, you know, because when, when you go down uh, with the herd, your production is going down, so your cost price is, uh, is getting up probably sometimes double. Jeroen van Manneren says Dutch farming practices are amongst the best and importing from far off shores could bring problems. So we're actually producing on the highest standard available in the world. When you cut down farming up here, it will come back in, in countries like Brazil. First of it, they have to kill nature for it. And it's actually original nature, which was not created by, uh, by men. Um, so we're just moving production from uh, high standard countries in Europe to low standard countries all around the globe. So for every cow which we cull in Holland, there's coming three cows back in Brazil. But right uh, up there, you know, they don't look at animal welfare, they don't look at the use of antibiotics, they don't look at the use of hormones, they don't look at uh, pollution uh, from the environment. So the, 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 what we win up here, you know, it's coming back uh, four times in Brazil. So, so we're just moving and expanding the problem. The Republic of Ireland are now looking at ways to reduce their herds and British farmers fear the same or similar may happen in the UK, further reducing homegrown food supply and increasing reliance on cheaper global food imports. Doogie Beattie, GB News, Holland.